everyone, it's Holly, the Twister Sister, and it's Tuesday, so that means it's time for Tutorial Tuesday and another free balloon animal tutorial just for you guys. We are continuing with some Valentine's themed tutorials, and this week we are going to do the Love Dinosaur. It's going to be a cute little T-Rex inside of heart, super cute, so get ready. this T-Rex we're gonna be doing a lime green and a white 260 the white I've just inflated about halfway and the green I've left about a two inch tail this is sort of like my favorite T-Rex of all time that I did way back when um, but this one's a little bit modified to make it slightly faster and simpler so we are going to start off I like to start off with the eyes so I'm just gonna do two two inch bubbles try to make them the same size and twist them together. Then we're going to go on to the green and do two more bubbles just slightly larger than the eyes and twist those together. Okay and then with the white we're going to do small bubbles down the side to fit right in this crease here for his teeth. I usually do about three bubbles on each side just small round circle bubbles and then I used to always do a roll through on these to lock them in but you really don't need to. I'm just going to pull tight and go right over the front of the mouth like that and come back down the other side. Every time you do a roll through I feel like it increases your chance of there uh, being a pop or a slow leak or something like that. And so I just don't do them if I really don't need to anymore. Okay so there we have the face of our T-Rex. Once you get to this point you can get rid of the rest of your white and just wrap that up around his eyes and his mouth and stuff to lock it in there. All right, now T-Rex doesn't have a super long neck, so we're just gonna come down about like this. We're gonna give him some little like puppy dog feet, arms, leg things. So just about two or to three inch bubbles. Okay, fold that over. Those are gonna be his short little front arms like this. Then we're going to give him a three bubble body to kind of fill out his tummy, make him look like he just ate some really big dinosaur. So one bubble, back up for another one and bring the rest of your balloon down. And you do have to do a roll through on this part. Roll it on through there. Now at this point you kind of have to pause because we're going to need to attach his back legs into our heart, which we haven't made yet. So let's go ahead and make our heart. I'm going to be using a chrome pink because it's beautiful and I'm also out of light pink 260s or my daughter has hidden them from me and I just can't find them yet. All right, so I'm using a chrome pink, which I've inflated fully, tied the ends together, but before I did that, I let out a bunch of air, so this is very pliable, squishy, and soft. All right, it's going to be easy to make our little heart shape, which we're going to do by getting the center of our balloon, bringing it all the way down to the knot, and then kind of folding everything up like this, and squeezing, squeezing, squeezing. All right, that's a nice little heart shape, I think. So we're gonna take our T-Rex now. I'm gonna do his first leg, just about a three inch bubble here. And we're going to lock him onto the bottom of our heart and bring like the rest of that green balloon back up to the body and twist these two together right here. And you wanna kinda get that heart, it's not twisted around the bottom of his feet, it's just kinda going in between those two bubbles. So you can really have more flexibility over how this guy sits. I think it's super cute with him like popping out of the heart like this. So these legs are actually faced one in front of the other, which might seem a little funny, but I think when you just look at the whole design overall, nobody really notices that his legs are one in front of the other. <laughs> um, but that's about it. That's what I would do for this guy. It's a three balloon, really easy, fast, uh, funny line work design for Valentine's Day. If you wanted to step it up a little bit, you could get fancy and add like some dark green dots along or bubbles along his back for some spikes. But for now, I'm just gonna leave it like this and finish him off with some Sharpie art. Ta-da! There we go. <laughs> so there's our cute little T-Rex. I made him a nice T-Rex and that's a little tip for you when you are making these, especially for kids and dinosaurs in general. I always ask, like to ask the kids that I'm making this for, is this gonna be a nice dinosaur or a mean dinosaur? And that way you'll know if you should make it more on the scary side with some angled eyebrows 
or make it just like have a nice friendly face like this. So you get to ask your little customers what they would like. But that's how I did mine. I hope you guys like this easy, fast tutorial. We do have clip art available for this design. This would also be a fun one to put on a wand. Um, do like a six petal flower or a stick or something, a twisty wand base so that it's easier to hold on to. But this is cute by itself and it's a fast line work design. So grab your clip art for that over at the store or if you're a Twister Hood member, you get it for free. If you guys are looking for other Valentine's Day tutorials, check out some of the suggested videos over here. I'll see you in one of those videos. Until then, happy twisting everyone. Bye-bye.